Today we will talk about post-operative fever. Definition, causes and workup. The definition is so simple, but before we will go through this mnemonic, wind, water, walk, wound, and wonder about drugs. These are the post-operative days, the occurrence during this post-operative days. Day one to two, wind, three to five water, four to six walk and wound four to seven and above seven days post-operative wound about drugs. The definition first, it is core body temperature more than 38 Celsius degrees for two consecutive post-operative days or just 39 Celsius degrees for one day post-operatively. Remember, the five W's, wind, water, walk, wound, wonder about drugs. So the wind, water, walking, wound, and wonder about drugs is just in front of you. So day one to day two, post-operatively, the lungs. Wind, wind means the lungs. Think about pneumonia and atelectasis and also PE can be early. Water, post-operative day three to five, think about urinary tract infection and especially catheter-associated UTI. And please wound but before wound, we'll go through walking or veins or veins. This means DVT and PE. This is a post-operative day four to six. Wound. This means that surgical site infection or a bloodstream infection, flip bites, cellulites related to IV lines either central or peripheral. And drugs, think about drugs, this mean uh, anticoagulation, antibiotics, and also drug-related reaction, either a febrile non-hemolytic transfusion reaction or transfusion-related acute lung injury. So in the first one, you are going to suspect pneumonia. So you are going to ask for chest X-ray and sputum sample to be sent to the lab. In the UTI, you will send urine dipstick and MSU, which is urine culture and micro sensitivity. And the walk, so you will see whether the patient complaining of symptoms and signs of DVT, like swollen cough or shortness of breath or sinus tachycardia. This means that this patient might have DVT or PE, pulmonary embolism. Start Wills score assessment, D-dimer and CTPA if PE is likely. For surgical site infection, expose the whole body, the surgical site first, see whether the wound is dry and healthy or cellulitic edematous and seems that oozing pus. And also expose the whole body for any flip bites related to um, IV lines either central or peripheral. And also please expose the whole body for lower limb cellulites and decubitus or pressure ulcer, which can be the cause of this fever. And also the drugs, check the drug chart of the patient, see whether he is on antibiotics or no, and see whether he is on anticoagulation or any drug allergy. 
we have finished. Thank you so much.